Okay, what's happening? Thanks for checking out my video. We're going to jump right into it. Let's try out the cheapest beer in Spain. At least the cheapest beer I've been able to find. Um, so it's really kind of funny over here. Uh, let me set the scene here real quick too. Got a couple of cats napping in the background. Just a little rental that I picked up here, staying here for about a week or so. In downtown Barcelona, it's pretty cool. Very affordable as well. So I just found buying beer over here, even in the grocery stores. Um, this was 24 cents in euros. It's, pardon me, it's a little bit loud out here, but so that's like maybe 30 cents. And just at the grocery store, you can just buy beers just individually, just rip open 12 packs or whatever and just buy them individually. Buy four beers, buy eight beers, buy seven, whatever. Um, and you can kind of buy them by the six pack or whatever too, but you really don't get a big discount. Um, so it's just kind of a little bit different and funny. Um, I have not seen this in any of the convenience stores or the supermarkets uh, for sale individually, but your typical decent beer here is about 60, 70, or 80 cents in euro, so roughly a dollar. And again, even just buying them individually. So this is the cheapest one I've seen at any of the stores. Let's try it out. I guess you say that's El Aguila Negra, Cervezo Tipo Pilsner. So I'm imagining it's a Pilsner of some sort. Um, I do see beer, German, Cerveza, Spanish. I'm sure that just means beer in other languages. Yeah, let's give it a shot here. Definitely looks like a Pilsner. Very light and golden in color. El Abadora desde 1900. So it's been around for a long time, since 1900. Salud. Oh. <clears throat> yeah. It's definitely a, a Pilsner beer. I mean, it's got a, it's got a fair, even little uh, crisp finish to it. Definitely has a Milwaukee's Best barky type aftertaste and uh yeah i'm all right with that i mean for 30 cents a can shit man uh maybe getting me some more aguile i've been over here for going on three weeks now in spain and i haven't blown through my budget completely and i can certainly draw on more funds or whatever but i did come over here with a certain amount of money that i changed over into cash that i'm trying to make it and be on a budget and i've definitely splurged a lot and so uh and i'm not drinking like every day anyway so i'm just kicking back like going to more parks and stuff because you can drink in the public here anyway so i'm picking up more stuff from the grocery stores staying out of the restaurants i think that's also a fun way to find out more about a place anyways uh, when you're visiting it to do stuff like that so yeah I'm, I'm kind of going on the cheap rolling with the uh, Aguila Negra but uh, yeah I'm gonna get back to this yeah it really makes me think of Milwaukee's best for some reason I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing but uh, you know what I'll give it a thumbs up so uh, yeah why not Anyway, do the same thing for the video, why not? That'll be super cool. And hit that subscribe button, even better. Most importantly, have a wonderful day.